Mark woken at home, Boxing Day. Doesn't get much bigger than that, does it? No, it's a, a big game for our fans. Um, we're well aware of that. Um, but us as a as a team, it, the next game is always the biggest game. This is this is the biggest game, um, and it's one that we've got to fully focus on. It's one that we've got to take the emotion out of the game and just focus on on executing our processes and sticking to what we are. Looking at where you've come in, obviously, as a manager halfway through the season, well, just before halfway of the season, how have you reflected on your time so far as a manager here? Well, I don't think we give ourselves much time to, to reflect. It's always what next, We're always focusing on the next goal. Um, but our plan was always to come in and, and, and try and um, install the way that we want to do things, our standards, let the players know their roles and responsibilities. And sometimes that, that takes time um, to create habits, um, take, takes a lot, lot longer. Um, but the, the lads have been great since the first day we've come in. It's a, it's a young group, it's a hungry group, it's a group that wants to get better. And we've thoroughly enjoyed our time since we've been in here. Um, we've had some positive results off late, um, that, but that was built on since day one, since we come in, and the attitude and the application of the boys. Um, you, you know, we, 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 we've suffered together, we've worked hard together, and uh, we're starting to build some character and some togetherness through that. And, uh, you know, it's certainly those those darker times, those tougher times, which I think has, has made us what we are today. And, um, you know, we're, we're going to be working hard every day. I say the same things every week, that the job never changes. It's always working hard, looking for those marginal gains, keep looking to improve. And, and that's certainly our, our mantra and it, it never will change. We're always looking to be better. We're always, we, we've got to remain humble and we've got to remain hungry. You spoke about it as well. It's one of the youngest squads in the league so far since you've been in charge. And with the magnitude of the game on Boxing Day, for them it's going to be no doubt one of the most exciting games for them in their career so far. Yeah, it's, they don't come much bigger than this. Uh, they're going to be very excited. It's up to me to manage that and, and them to manage themselves as well in what is uh, going to be a very loud game. There's going to be a lot, no, a lot of noise around it on the way in and there's going to be a lot of noise during it as well. So um, another great experience for us. Like you said, we are the youngest team in the league, like fielding the youngest team in the league by some mile but like I said that's no excuse we're, we're working with these players on the, on the regular now and, and, and we can see what great potential they have um, you know the, 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 the next challenge for them is consistency is to keep doing it week in week out this league is brutally tough this year it's the toughest it's ever been and, and um, every week is a new challenge a different challenge and at the moment we're learning and we're learning quickly we're learning a lot um, but we've got to want more. We've got to want more. And um, we've got to keep entertaining our crowd. We've got to keep um, getting that energy from them as well because we feed off each other. Um, and it's so important we give them something to cheer about because they can see that there's young lads at the moment putting that shirt on and giving everything. Um, we've been operating with probably 50% of our squad since we've been in here. Um, so we've got lots of players to come back. We've got lots of things to be excited about. But... It's about the here and now. It's about making sure that we have complete clarity in what, we, what we've got to do in this game and the up-and-coming games. And um, hopefully a few of our players will start to join us soon and come back. And um, we'll look in a, in a strong place. But um, what I can say is throughout the trials and the tribulations, we've um, loved every second being here. It's, a, it's such a proud moment to be announced as manager of Aldershot. Um, it's such a proud moment for me and my family every time I, I get to manage and lead, lead this group um, and um, you know the staff and the players since I've come in have been, have been fantastic but um, you know sometimes Christmas is a little bit time for the reflection for a lot of people but not me as a, as a manager it's always about what next how can we be better and um, yeah how can we how can we make training better how can we be better in games how can we look after these players in a, in a tough period um, with a lot going on outside at the moment the doom and gloom of Covid um, is a frustration and a lottery for, for me at the moment and um, yeah we just have to keep reacting in the best way possible and that's, that's all we've done since we've been here I think it'd be fair to say the boys have done that since you know as you said about reflecting and things like that you know a six game unbeaten run is something that you must be proud of the boys as well yeah we, we, we are but you know can't dwell on that can't look at that you know we've hopefully we're building a strong foundation um, and all, all, all we can do is, is keep working hard um, Keep believing, keep pushing each other, keep demanding more from each other, and see where it takes us. Um, you know, the, the objective has never changed: get as many points on board as quick as we can and secure our, our status in 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 a, in a tough, tough league. And we're going into a tough period as well. This is real testing times, and again, with everything else going on around it. So, 
the next challenge is, is always right around the corner. Um, so we've got to make sure that we're, we're ready to move quickly, we're ready to react quickly and we're ready to keep working hard. And it'd be a great like, Christmas present for fans, wouldn't it, to give them a win over one of our biggest rivals? Yeah, you know, no one wants that more than me, believe me. But um, like I said, full focus on the job. We've got, to, we've got to make sure we execute the things that will give us the best chance of doing that. Um, like I said, we've got to make sure that we come full of energy. Um, we've also got to be clever. Um, we've got to make sure that we um, give our fans something to shout and cheer, cheer about. Given your history with the games against Woking, how important is it that you take those experiences you've taken and make sure the boys from this day and age are you know, ready for it and understand what it means to the club and how, how to deal with the pressure of it? Yeah, listen, I've got great memories of the, of the game and uh, ones I cherish and take to my grave with me. And, and these players have got that opportunity to do that as well. Um, so... You know, you'll be remembered forever if you uh, perform and have a good moment and have good moments and good, good performances in these games. So, um, you know, the carrot's no bigger. We know that. Um, but like I said, it's, it's full focus on, on the job and, and giving ourselves the best chance in the game. It's the old cliche, isn't it? Obviously, we've gone into it in really good form. Woking, maybe not so well, but it's a derby game. Anything can happen. You would know that better than anyone. Yeah, everything, everything's out the window. It's a, it's a, a, a different type of game. It'll be a, a special atmosphere. And, um, yeah, that's, like I said, we're certainly not looking into form. Woking had great form. Um, you know, a very good side, very good players. They're well put together, experienced management team. The challenge is big. Um, like I said, they've, um, you know, people talk about noisy neighbours. They've made a, a lot of noise with a lot of big signings uh, and big experienced players. So um, the, ch the challenge is big, um, but we thrive under that. And we look forward to that and we, uh, we can't wait for it. Are you a movie shot? Look below for more information. Click here for the next video. Click here to subscribe.